Hello everybody, welcome back to a new video. First of all I want to say I'm so sorry I couldn't manage to make you more videos lately because I'm very very occupied with personal things. So now I have a little bit time so I want to make you a quick video. So lately it was hard to make a test because too much update and the result was not that accurate. So I had to leave it at least I think I leave it like one month from the last video I plug this amplifier like I promised you so this one it's called Uptronics it's made in the UK and he have only Rx and he not have by by bypass for TX so with this amplifier you will not be able to beacon I repeat with this amplifier you will not be able to beacon basically they call it preamp so if you are curious how to power it it will require you a micro usb cable like this to power it and it's very very simple here antenna and here Alex. sorry for the background my little girl <laughs> yeah I only he have a 16 dbi sorry it's sunny day 16 dbi 5 volt you can power him also with bist bst or bist how they call it the result was amazing he witnessed from 20 kilometer he witnessed it work very very well so this is i recommend it only only for people who have um, how to call who have rx and tx separated in their helium miner if you separated your rx and tx if you are basically managed to open your miner and separate your tx and rx this will help you to put it in the Eric side. He will help you to boost your witness. After that, I want to make another video about this, but I make it quickly because I'm not promise you I will have time to make another videos. I'm very occupied lately also. So I bought this also and I put it with the amplifier. So I try it without saw filter. This is a saw filter for the frequency of Europe and without so filter he work he witness from 20 kilometer and when he send the beacon the beacon doesn't cross and if you have just one miner i tried with one miner when the beacon doesn't cross the miner stop working because nobody witnessed my beacon your miner he will stop working remember that so i had to add a second miner with the with splitter like this when one miner send the beacon he get blocked with the amplifier he come back to the second miner so they will witness here the signal will cross also from the from the um, splitter slash combiner and he will give me rssi too high and i will get invalid but at least he will continue to work he will be he will stop working like one day or how to say seven hours sometimes he stop work witnessing for one day because rssi too high now it's programmed from helium when you get invalid your miner take a break like seven hours until 24 hours okay just be careful from the invalid after that i add to him so filter basically from the antenna side it was plugged like this two miners splitter the the eric side he goes to the minor side this is to the antenna and after that i add the so filter to filter the signal i, I witness nothing if i remember correctly he witnessed one day or something after that i start to witness nothing i get zero reward for a one month i have zero reward with the saw filter so in my situation saw filter he killed the result 
maybe for your situation it will be better because the US signal is always stronger so filters and cavity filters doesn't because remember this at least he will take 3 dBi from your power so when you put him here and you will have antenna outside I have the here the antenna outside 5.8 track antenna when he will receive the signal and he will reduce it 3 dBi so most of them doesn't cross into the amplifier this is huge loss I told you I get zero reward with the soft filter as you know the rack miners they have inside them already built in soft filter so doesn't need soft filter but me I was curious it was cheap 13 25 euros or 30 euros I bought it in Amazon but Amazon he ship it from China. I don't know. It was an Amazon seller. It's like you buy from AliExpress, something like this. It take like months until he come. One month or two months until I receive it. Yeah. So this it work perfect. Only, only if you have RX and TX separated. Don't. If you tell me you want to use it in the same situation like this no beacon you will lose money on your beacon and you always get invalid when you get invalid your miner take a break between seven hours to one day doesn't work so in my opinion it doesn't worth it to put 100 euro amplifier or not let your tx to cross lately you need to beacon and to witness you need to collect hnt from any situation as possible the rewards they are down he must to be careful so now after I finish this and I show you how to power it I was powering it with 5 volt separated and this I didn't use it to power the miner it's just to be to make sure that he get stable 5 volt for him and each miner he have his own power supply and this setup guys is not supposed to stay here I use it only lately I use it for testing for you things so don't think I'm far 20 kilometers from miners so this is not profitable for me at all this is only for YouTube channel to test with them I have a house for them just I'm very very occupied to go to put to them like I said guys I'm very very busy that's why I couldn't make videos for you and to not make this video any longer I'm sorry I just press record just to make the videos so the result about this I repeat again guys don't spend 100 euro on this amplifier preamp only if you have RX and TX separated if you want to use it with multiple miners all your miners they will not be able to beacon and they will always get invalid 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 because when he send just one beacon and he get just one witness and he's invalid immediately he send another beacon immediately he send another beacon he will send like four or five beacons non-stop and this is not good sign for you maybe the helium network will detect you and put you in the blacklist so I don't advise I just test for you on my own risk don't test on your on your miners so me I can risk my stuff you it's your responsibility okay only if you have rx and tx separated now my opinion about the cavity filter uh, so filter i don't like basically he he will filter the signal very very well people who get too much invalid maybe he will help them to reduce some signal 3 dbi but me i recommend to put 15 dbi in your helium app and finish you will not get any more invalid after that but your beacon will be weak when you put 15 today I plug it again helium where is it I'm out of focus I put the helium amplifier the flame booster HE this is the 10 dBi like as you know guys I have two of them one is already installed he's doing great knock on the wood and this one 
It was laying around at home. Like I said, I supposed to install it. I was very busy. I couldn't manage to install. Yeah. Now I'm testing it one more time for you to compare what happened because this I tested him before the update. He was working very well. I want to see the result after the update. If he will witness anything or will not witness. I'm curious. I like to test. And I will share my result with you. And guys, the people who email me and they answer them, I still not get from you the feedback about your result. Some of you they send, but 90% of you they just ask information. They never tell me if their setup work very well or they call you only when they have problems. So when their setup work very well, they not want to share the result. And not tell them, tell me the names of mine, only tell me. Is working good or not good? Simple as that. Okay, I have a lot of surprise for you. Stay tuned for the next video. I will show you. I have surprise. See you in the next video. Bye.